Game Studio. Let's take a look at some of the new features of version 1.3. We've got a level wave settings prefab in the scene. We'll go ahead and create one spawner, one wave of elimination type. Now go into the spawner. We'll make one wave that spawns eight things all at once. Time to spawn equals zero. New feature. Happen in one frame. And using the incremental settings, we will say the distance x will increase by that amount for each successively spawned thing in the wave. Take a look. Now we'll show off the rotation incremental settings. We'll use a UFO because it just goes forward after you rotate it. That's what the script does. We're going to put the distance back to zero, and we're going to say that each successively spawned item rotates 22 and a half degrees, 16 of them. That should make a whole circle. And it works. Okay, let's use a UFO2 this time, which travels backwards along the forward axis, and we'll use the post spawn nudge setting to make it a larger ring. It's further away from the spawner when it starts. Then they travel backwards and become the other ring. Now let's take a look at the prefab pools, new feature. You go ahead and create it from the top level level weight settings. Create it underneath the hierarchy. We'll create three items in the pool, drag them in. They each have a default weight of one, which is how often they will spawn compared to the others in the pool. Now we'll go here into the spawner and have it use the pool instead and repeat. We'll have it do this many items. Take a look. They're all coming out of the spawner as one wave. So we get three UFOs and one of each of those. Then the pool is refilled. You get the same again. Let's go ahead and add another spawner using the same prefab pool at the same time. Doesn't matter how many you have. It will refill when it runs out. We'll have this one spawn a few more guys. It's already refilled a couple times here. And as soon as they are eliminated, it spawns another. Those are the new features in version 1.3. If you have anything else you'd like to see, please drop us a line or in the Unity thread in the forum.